is a crypto moose and the moose is loose. So I'm just going to hit refresh here on meld.com. If you haven't seen already, they have updated the website a little bit. So you can see this nice UI, which is user interface. And what we're going to do is create a wallet. So I'm going to show you how to do that. And it's definitely amazing that they've hit all these different milestones. So they recently just had an event. And as you can see, they have the DAO testnet, the DAO mainnet, and everything is looking to be complete. So what we're going to do is just go up to the top right and we're just going to create a new account. So we're going to see what we can get access to. We've already done the test net here in the channel. So definitely check that out as well. So we're going to hit I've read um, the and agreed to the terms in disclaimer and we're going to create a wallet. So we're going to allow device is going to be the moose's device. We're going to log into our Google. I'm going to choose my crypto moose email and then what I'm going to do is hit next and now it's going to create the wallet so now I'm going to put in a password so let's put in something that only the moose would know only the moose unless you have antlers you're never going to figure this out So we're going to blur some of this out and we won't save this for now. So the wallet has been encrypted. Go to the wallet. So there we go. Congratulations. You have your wallet ready. So this is probably going to be the wallet that I use for the channel. I'm going to have a personal one, which I've already set up through the test net. So there we go. I just wanted to get an idea of what it would look like. Um, as you can see, we don't really have anything set up. So we got our G meld here. We've got our AVAX ETH. Where's my gold bank manager? They don't have that for me. This is what I don't understand. If the crypto moose is going to sign into his email, like at least airdrop me a, a gold bank manager. Come on, meld. Definitely a really cool user interface here. Okay, so that's really cool. Let's go to the top right. And here we can connect to NAMI. Looks like we have our different public addresses. Really cool. Connect to MetaMask. So it even has my name, Mitchell.Bouchard. So here we can connect, connect to MetaMask, which is really cool. So we'll go to Wallet instead of Staking. And what we're going to do is just connect a Wallet. So we're going to hit on NAMI here, which should be connected now. So loading data from your external NAMI. So I do like this. I like how it has a very simple integration right here. And this is definitely very interesting. I wasn't able to log in my other one that I have, but that's okay. The Moose has quite a few emails. Also, comment down below what other videos you would like to see covered here on the channel. I would really like to know. This is going to help us produce more content that you're all looking for. Also, comment down below. If you own any meld and if you own any cornucopias, those are the top two low cap altcoins that I love that are being built on this blockchain. So definitely let me know. So we'll let that load and all in all, I think that was pretty swift, pretty seamless. I do like that. I like the flow. I always, I always like the flow of this. And when I click, you can see the coin amount and then the dollar amount being represented as well. I really do like that. And then you have a message here for the bugs, request a feature, give feedback. I like that they still have that. And the colors are looking good. The branding looks awesome. And again, this is just the beta. And I like this because this is an all-in-one place where you can connect your wallets and you could really become your own bank. It's just really nice to see all this come into fruition because it's been a while, right? Um, I remember reading the white paper and I barely read the moose, the moose is a moose, right? So he's out in the wilderness. He barely gets to read. One thing I wanted to mention that's very important is that because this is a non-custodial wallet, meaning that you do own your private keys. So if anything ever happens to the wallet and you want to make sure that you're able to recover your funds, what you're going to do is go to the top right and you're going to click on show seed phrase. So I'm going to click on it. And of course, with that editing, I'll blur it out. But I want you to write these down and keep the piece of paper 
or the piece of metal that you're writing down on in a safe space. This will give you access to the wallet if you ever have to recover your funds. So if you're using the wallet and it's not through your NAMI or a different device, make sure that when you do set up your wallet that you do back up your recovery phrase. So I just wanted to mention that. So anyways, I just wanted to show you guys how to create a wallet. This is the meld beta. And what we will do is leave a link in the description below for you to sign up. And that's all we have for you. We'll see you in the next one.